morning. It's Friday, 7.07. Um, say hello to my new friend. And this one's like the size of Mars. Anyway, uh, we are leaving soon. We are. I just woke up at the American Hotel Hostel and our Amtrak train leaves from King Station at 7.45. So we're going to leave in 10 minutes so we can catch it and get there early so we can catch it. <laughs> but I'll show you around the hostel. Our room's a mess. Don't judge. Last night, by the way, we walked 21,000 mi uh, <laughs> miles. <laughs> Steps. Almost 10 miles. And I think it was like 48 flights climbed. Because we climbed. Oh my gosh. Sorry, guys. I cannot talk this morning. And 48 stairs climbed. We did a lot, so I'm really tired today, but we must continue. We must go on. I'm really excited for the train. All right, I'll video more when we are at the station. We started here at the hostel, went in this area, went to see the Fremont Troll, and walked all the way to Cary Park. I would say we explored Seattle. some lockers and then yeah but it's cute because there's a bunch of a light a bunch of outlets a fan the only thing that sucks is this thing like does not stay on kind of drove me crazy but everything else is pretty comfortable so that's the room bye and this is the american hotel okay goodbye we'll see you later <laughs> 724, we have 20 minutes. Of course it's raining, but it's fine. Got my big old suitcase and we gotta go. Hopefully we can get coffee before. Okay. I like these little pillar things. Look at that tree. Oh my god, look at all those people. Holy moly. Tired and unprepared, no coffee, no snacks, but we made it. Seattle coffee. Ready to go. Now press it and then press. 
pressure. It's gonna... Oh, wow. Cheers, thank you. Not much better than this coffee. Oh, stop, I'm sure. And if it doesn't, that's Seattle's best fault. This, I know. <laughs> here this is my review for my short stay at the American Hotel which is a hostel in Seattle it's located at 520 King Street Seattle Washington it's southwest of Pike Place Market it's about a 25 minute walk or so from there to Pike Place Market and what I really liked about the hostel was they have a 24-hour kitchen and every morning they had free coffee cereal tea bagels, um, fruit, there was banana, oranges, toast, peanut butter, pretty sure they had jelly and butter, so things like that, and it was for free, which was really nice and tasty, and the coffee was endless, which is always good in the morning, speaking of, it's not even the morning though. Friend and I stayed in the two-bedroom room, and it had two bunk beds. The bunk beds were decent size, comfortable. The only thing was that my bed cover, bed sheet cover, kept popping off. So I kept putting it on, putting it back on, you know, as much as I could. So it was a little annoying, but everything else was like convenient. We had a sink in there, so we were able to like brush our teeth. There was enough space for the both of us. It would have been a little more cluttered if she had a bigger bag, because I had a big bag which took up like the whole side. And she used more of like by the desk area. So it would have been tight if we had both big suitcases. But we made it work. I'm usually the only one that packs a lot. So that works out for me when traveling with lighter travelers. There's a coffee shop next door. So if you don't want the coffee from there, you can get it next door. Everyone was really nice. We had come in really late. I think it was probably about 12 at night by the time we got in. And there was a gentleman, he wasn't there right away, but you can like ring a bell. And he was, took him like uh, less than a minute to get to us. So that was convenient. Everyone else that stayed there was really friendly. The bathrooms were clean, which is important. I think there was actually, by our area, there was two single bathrooms. And then my friend said that there was a bigger area for I don't know if she said toilets or showers. I didn't even see. We only stayed there for a day and a half, so I didn't really get a chance to check everything out. And I like those bathrooms. They're right around the corner from us, solo, so I didn't have to worry about anything or anyone. And like I said, they were always clean, and I enjoyed that very much. There was laundry, foosball table. I think it's foosball. The little thingies. Little thingies with the players. We did not play. There was a TV room, a lot of like pamphlets and things like that for you to explore Seattle. What else? Yeah, I don't know. That's pretty much it. You know, it was very convenient, conveniently located. Everyone was nice. The breakfast was great. The coffee was good, uh, free. That's good. And the beds were comfortable. So we had our privacy, the housekeepers and everyone, the maids were really nice. I'd like to say hi to everyone and everyone said hi back. Um, yeah, so we didn't have any problems. Easy to check in, easy to check out. Slept good, out all day. Showers were nice and hot. That's it. So that is my review for the American Hotel, which is a hostel in Seattle. I believe it's part of the hosteling international group and i'll put the link below if you like this video give it a thumbs up subscribe share it your friends leave me a comment if you're staying here if you have stayed here 
How was your experience? Let me know. I'd love to hear from you. Ciao for now.